All right, to get into those settings, have the computer completely turned off. Then you need to find the volume rocker over here on the side. And for this, you're going to want to hold the volume up, the one with the little plus on it, and hold that in. Then go to power and turn it on as normal. Keep holding that volume up. And here we are. There are not a whole lot of settings you can fiddle with. Security device support, you can enable or disable. If you hit enter, it gives you the options for enable or disable. Now, secure boot control, a lot of people will be looking for that. <clears throat> it's enabled by default to change it. You just tap enter and go up. You can also use the, uh, the mouse here. So you can enable it, disable it here. There's also uh, install default secure boot keys, delete all secure boot keys and exit setup. And that's about it. So that secure boot control is probably what most people are looking for. That's where you turn it off and you can turn it back on later. Once you've made your changes, you go to exit setup and it asks you, do you want to save the configuration and reset? We will say yes. There you go. Now it's going to reboot.